Hey guys, I just see 101 here, yet again, bringing you, hope you like that dramatic intro, some Magic 2012. Um, I'm playing Apex and I'm going to keep this hand. It's only two lands, but it's pretty pretty decent for an Apex hand. Um, he's played a red, so Unquench wouldn't be bad. This matchup isn't the worst for the worst for Apex. Hopefully I can draw a land, because then that will give me land drop four. Um, and then I'll be, and then that'll be land drop five. So, so yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I've got enough land or land getting cards in my hand to get my Grooks pack leader down. Um, he is playing Unquench, but Kiln Fiend turn two didn't mean to stop timer. Sorry, a guy. Um, Kiln Fiend turn two is not good. Um, um, so I am just going to play. If I play Nature's Law, I will have three lands for next turn, so then I'm playing, uh, there's no point. Um, I'm just going to get Grook's Companion down there. Probably going to die, but at least it's fodder. Um, I say it's not the worst matchup in the world, but it probably is. It's not the best. I mean, Unquench is a very strong deck. You just need a lot of high-powered creatures to be able to um, get past them. But... Um, if he stuck at land drop 2, then that would be the best thing. There's Bulk Hammer. Didn't see that coming in a million years. Didn't see that coming. Um, but it does look like he stuck at land drop 2. The trouble is, Unquench has a lot of very good 2 drops. So I guess I am going to play Borderland Ranger this turn. Um, there's another land, which is good. That means I can play Nature's Law next turn. I would have had some decent draws. Mm, it would have been a pretty good run. No lands, but it would have been a been a good run of, of draws there. So a bit disappointed I shuffled my library. But, you know, these things ha must happen. I mean, you can't just sit there hoping you get good draws. And that's a job about playing one show your whole deck. Um, okay, there's there's Chandra's Phoenix. Not too worried about that because I have this guy. That will be able to wall her off pretty convincingly. Um, for a while anyway. Okay, he's going he's gonna to swing in. Um, if I had a giant growth here, he'd be. Uh, would I really waste a giant growth? Probably not. Probably not. Um, but I guess there's no point not swinging in. I might. I might be an idiot, not block. I guess it doesn't do any harm for him to swing in. Maybe he didn't know that had reach. Who knows? Serrated arrows is a good draw. Um, can I nature? No, nature's law give me three. I could centaur. Next turn I can play Grook's Pack Leader, so I probably want to save that for that. I'll play Serrated Arrows this turn. Swing in with my um, guy, Borderland Ranger. Forgot his name for a while there. Um, but as soon as I get this guy out, um, he, it shouldn't be too bad. He's obviously not going to block here. Um, but I do have Serrated Arrows out, which is good. Um, he's... I don't even know what I want him to play. Um, land drop four, probably Chandra's Phoenix, something like that. Um, he's getting close to his. Okay, Sizzle's fine. I can deal with Sizzle. I'll take four. Um, okay, he's going to swing again. He's leaving himself very vulnerable. Swinging on in there, expect for dealer no damage. It's a very weird play. I don't know what, why he's doing that. But I'm at nine. I've only just realised. Um, so I could have killed his Kiln Fiend by now, but anyway, there's Grook's Pack Leader. Probably going to get Chandra's Phoenix. Chandra's Phoenix, Chandra's Outrage. Um, so I am just going to swing in. And then I am... I'll see if I can trick him with Straight Arrows. If he plays one spell, if he killed my um, Grook's Pack Leader, then it's irrelevant. Land drop fine could mean lava axe, could mean fire servant, and then lava axe next turn. Um, there's oh okay that guy's a little bit vanilla. Okay let's see what he does here. Stop timer. Oh, I messed up there. Proper messed up. But anyway, let's do it to him. No, let's do it to him. I kill and fiend could lose me this game. I can chump that guy when I want to. Um, there's a land. So that's nature's law. Might as well get the lands out there. Might as well. Um, I'd have had some decent draws again. Overrun would have been nuts. I've seen that near the top of my library twice now. Um, 
Okay, that's fine. I drew a Glazing Glade Heart, so that will be good for next turn. I wish I'd have saved my Nature's Law now, though. Um, let's see if he gets snow, because he still has 4 damage, so nah. Get back here. It'd still be a 4 3, so there's no point. His Kill Feed is still a bit useless. He's got no cards that he can play, only instants and sorceries, apparently. Um, if he wants to swing in, I shall chuck my Centaur at it. I'll straight it arrows and centaur kill it. Um, so at his end step I'll kill his... Okay. Um, stop timer. Kill on that. Um, oh, was he stopped time as well? Okay. So what's he got? What does he have? It is definitely him who stopped the timer. Um, what he, the only instance I can think about are Chandra's Phoenix, Chandra's Outrage, and Incinerate Voice Crack. I know. Um, they're the only instance that I know of. Um, are there any other? I know that deck pretty well, and I can't think of that many more instances. Um, so I'm happy to take that trade. I guess it was just pausing the look. Giant Spider is nice as well. So let's play Glade Heart. Um, that guy, Giant Spider. Unfortunately, Grix Pack Leader doesn't get any any boosts. Um, he doesn't have any haste, I think. So I can swing on in with these two. Um, I still have this anyway. He's going to Chandra's Phoenix, that guy. Um, he was thinking of doing that last turn, but I guess now's as good a time as any. Um, volcanic Fallout. Okay, has he got a Volcan... Okay, so that clears m some of my side. And then has he got a Volk Hammer for this? Punishing Fire. Okay. Fair enough, you've killed my... You've killed my Grooks Pack Lead and you take zero damage. Or you take two from... Um, part from Volcanic Fallout, but that's fine. Um, all his guys die anyway. He does get his Chandra's Phoenix back pretty easily, um, but I'm hoping to draw some creatures of my own soon. I mean, I've got enough land now. Um, I have to sit low and see what he draws. He could just hold Cam in my face just to get his guy back as Incinerate. Um, and he has the land to play and swing, but he's not going to swing because there's no point. Well, he might swing. I don't know. Um, do I really want to use my last count on that? He's got one card at hand. Um, he's not going to swing in. He's seen the error of his ways. That's a land. Um, just say go. I guess we're at a, a point in time where we're going to see who draws best. He is at a lot more life than I am. There's a land. Um, he's just going to... He's still not going to swing in. No, just saying go. He's got something to play. Um, Leatherback Bailoff is nice. That is a little bit large. The good thing is I do have two Reach guys. And um, he knows my Giant Spider can actually kill his... His Chandra's Phoenix. And he's still only got one card in hand. There's Banefire to the face. Yeah, that's game. That's a shame. He, I, don't, I guess he drew that this turn, so... That's a little bit disappointing. I was one turn away, I think, from winning that game. If he didn't draw Banefire there, I think I win. But it was an interesting game. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next Magic video. Later, guys.